Hey YouTube, if you're watching this video, please like, comment, share, and subscribe to our channel. Ain't gotta act like I'm about it, ain't asking no vouchers, I'm really a fish. Okay, I'm trying to look out for karma, I had good intentions, I'm still asking God to forgive. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So, basically, as you guys can tell by the title, this is my car crash incident, car crash story time, and yeah, I'm just gonna get right into it, y'all. Get your popcorn, get everything, cause this is it's funny, but it's sad, but it's funny. But yeah, okay, guys, let's get right to the video. Okay, so this was my dad's birthday, September 28th. I got my license on my birthday, which was the 15th. So. I was like, okay, and it was a Sunday when I, when this whole thing ended up happening. So I was like, okay, um, I drove to work. Yeah, drove to work, and then I got there, you know, da da da. da. And like weeks before that, it was or like a couple, no, it was a couple days before this, like before the actual day, the incident. I was talking to my boss, and I was like, yeah. Hey girl. I might just got my car. Well, I've been out of my car, but I just got my out of my mom's insurance. Um, yeah. Now I'm driving here. She was like, oh my gosh. I was like, yes. Like, I'm so happy. Like, yeah. So, total all that stuff, right? So then the next thing on for this, goodbye. Okay, now it's, yeah. So I go to my job, finish everything, time to go home. I'm like, okay, I feel like I should maybe call them and see if they want some cake or something, you know, for my dad's birthday. But I was like, now, cause I don't really, I don't think he really want that. Plus, I ain't about to pay for that right now. So then I was like, wait a minute, I want some sushi. And I was like, no, they're gonna have food at the place. They're gonna have food at the place. Let me not even do that. So I'm like, okay, let me just get in the car. So literally, y'all, I have like a sequence of things like I do when I'm getting ready to pull off. So I get in my car, I put my seatbelt on, then I turn my car on, I pull all my windows down, and I turn the station to whatever music I want to turn it to. Then. And then I look around, okay, everything good. Okay, then I pull up. Okay, y'all, so yeah. So I'm at the, I'm like, who? I'm like, hmm, I want to go through the, I don't want to, I, mean, I want to go through the McDonald's uh, drive, the like, you know, I can cut through, if I go through McDonald's, I can cut to get, to get closer to my house. So I was like, I want to go there. I'm like, nah, actually I feel like driving. Because I have my dad's so I don't feel like driving, I do feel like driving. I was like, now nah, I feel like, I have to feel like driving. So like, nah, I'm not gonna do but also before I pulled off, I was also like, I want to rush home. That's another thing. So yeah, because I was hungry and it was like I was trying to hurry and get home. Like, so I turn. I don't go through McDonald's driveway. I freaking turn, jamming, cooling it, driving. I don't even be on my phone, y'all. I don't be on my freaking phone. I don't be on it because I tried it one time, y'all. Literally one time and like. I, I t sort of sweared a little bit and I didn't like it. So I was like, let me not. Let me just, you know, get to figure out how to drive them before I start being on my phone and stuff. So, yes, y'all. Whatever. So I'm driving. Next thing you know, it was either, I either, I don't know what it was. I either was like, it don't like this song or something. Half a freaking second. And you know, stuff happens in literally half a freaking second, obviously. This is y'all testimony. Like, like, look, y'all. Like, I, I'm, I'm giving my testimony. Y'all see my, y'all hearing my testimony. So learn from it. Yeah. So uh, let's see. I think I saw him in, in, I think I saw him like earlier before in my, like in a distance. But I had a huge distance. So I'm like, okay. By the time I actually get down there, they should have turned wherever they about to go. So that's what I'm thinking too. So and I'm, and I'm, I'm going like my mileage is up there. Like, no, honestly, y'all. I think I'm going to speed limit. Honestly, I do. But the speed limit, either way, this y'all know the speed limit is pretty fast. Y'all know this. Especially when you're a new driver, that speed limit is pretty fast. 35 is pretty fast. 35 sort of feel like a 66, 65. It's pretty fast. So, yeah. So, I'm like, oh, shoot, oh, shoot. I'm pressing the brake, pressing the brake, pressing the brake. I'm like, oh, my God, oh, my gosh. In my head, I'm like, what's about to happen? I'm just like, what's about to happen? I was just like, I literally, like, literally, like, literally, I don't know. So I'm just press the brake, press the brake, press the brake, press the brake. I'm still going fast. Dang. I'm still going fast. Press the brake, press the brake, press the brake, press the brake. Still going fast. I'm like, dang, bump it. So I decided to swerve. So I 
swerved into the other lane and I freaking and I was cool y'all literally I swerved so I swerved basically onto incoming traffic so when I swerved like a big old truck was coming my way and it was another car like beside the truck so I was like okay I'm like dang she was long as I hit the car so literally when I swerved y'all it was quiet like like it was quiet for like maybe like a half a second and then all you heard was boom 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 I was like So I called my dad first. I called him first. He didn't answer. I'm like, dang. Call my sister Simone, cause I know she gonna answer. She ain't answer. I was like, so I'm like, okay, Simone didn't answer. So I'm like, okay. So I text her. I'm like, hey, I just got into an accident. It didn't send. So I said to my dad, I'm like, hey, I just got to. As soon as I send the text to Simone, she called back immediately. So I was like, hey, Simone. She was just like, what happened? I was like, I got she was like, oh my gosh, what happened? I was like, I'm okay, though. She was just like, okay. Hey, did you talk to God? I was like, no, we didn't answer. You guys, I love me. God, don't care about me. No one answered the phone. I called everybody. No one answered because no one cares about me. She was just like, it's okay, Steph. It's okay. Okay. I'm going to call Dad. Hurry up, dummy. <laughs> I'm going to call Dad. I'm like, okay. So she called him. I saw a text, I text my boyfriend friend, I was like, hey, baby, I just got into an accident. And when I was texting, I saw that he had just, he sent me, before I even pulled up, he sent me a text. He was like, get home safe. I didn't need to text, I didn't get home safe. So yeah, so then, and then I texted Priya, my best friend. I'm like, hey, girl, I got into an accident. So then my dad calls me. And I'm like, hey, I got into an accident. He was like, where you at? I was like, I was literally right by the pool. Like, I was literally so close to home. And he's just like, um, why was it your fault? Da, da, da. It was honestly, y'all, it was a freaking mess. Like, a mess. So then, so when the accident happened, let me reverse cloud and finish telling y'all the story. So the accident happened, and then when I, when like literally, I was able, like, I turned to look at them, and it was a dude and a girl in a car. And I was just like, like they were just normal like everything it was so quiet and it's for real for real, it's like everything was just moving in literally slow motion so i didn't even notice the dude got out the car and he ran inside to his house i didn't even notice so he ran inside so i noticed when he was coming back and i turned i was like oh you live right here he was like yeah i was like oh literally if you would have turned into your freaking driveway i wouldn't have hit you that's what I'm saying in my head, but I'm just like, uh, I'm like, oh, okay. So then, okay, so then I get out of my car. I'm like, what you need? He was like, um, I need your insurance and I need your, um, he was like, get my insurance. So I was like, oh, okay. So I'm like, I got my insurance. I ain't got no problem with that. So I go, I look it up. I got my insurance. I'm like, here you go. He takes a picture. I'm like, okay, I get your insurance. I don't know what I need, but I know you need something of mine. I need something of yours, period. Something of yours, period. Something of yours, period. So he's like, okay, I'll send it to you. I was like, okay. Time go by. The man don't even send it to me. So I'm like, oh, hey, you, you want to send me the insurance? He's like, oh, yeah, I got you. Got his stuff. And remember, y'all, whatever y'all gets an accident, don't forget. Please don't forget. You need to get the picture of the license. I That's something I did not do. I didn't get a picture of the driver's license. That's exactly what you need. You need the picture of the driver's license and you need their insurance. You need a picture of both. You take all the pictures you need. Take every freaking picture because if they end up getting an accident later on or something and they haven't got the car fixed and they still decide to get the car fixed, then, and they be like, oh, you caused that damage too? No, no, no. That's why you take a picture of everything so they can see how the car was when the accident happened and beforehand, all that and all that. So, yeah, so I get the information. Next thing you know, that's when I my dad, talked to my dad. I talked to my dad beforehand, all that. He was just hung up. He was like, okay, whatever. So then he was like, he'd be on his way. You know, he was like, call my grandfather, whatever, call him, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. 
So the next thing you know, the police come. He there. And I'm just boiling my eyes out. Because, so then I actually, know. So, because I didn't even look at the front of the car yet. I did not look at my car. I saw theirs. They was like, it wasn't that bad. I'm going to answer a picture y'all, of course. But to me, theirs wasn't that bad. So I'm like, oh, shoot. They're not that bad. So mine must not look that bad. Man, when I mean look that bad, y'all, literally. When I, I start walking to them, like. I see them like, no, and I was wondering because when like the accident happened, I tried to like turn in front of them so I can get in front of them because I was in I was in the other side of the street, so I need to get out the other side of the street. So like I tried to turn and my car would not move at all. And my sister told me to t turn it on and start it back up, but it, I don't even have no time to do all that. So anyways, so I like I was like, dang, my car is done, 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 done done it's not total but it's done it's like oh it's, dang i forgot to say so when i got to it right so literally like i would drive it and then th that happened but it's like the the speed you know how they be like the speed that you're going and when you get into accident like your body goes into that speed like that's how people's head going through windshields and stuff that actually happens so like when since i was driving a little i was telling i feel like honestly i thought i was driving speed up anyways so since i was driving and then that was driving a little fast or whatever so when i stopped like literally it was like dude like my body like if i wouldn't have swerved i would have went straight into the freaking car like just head on but yeah so my body ended up jerking into the into the speed that i was going to so like my i could feel my body shaking but it wasn't shaking if you know what i mean and it was very traumatic very traumatic experience um i'm good now I mean, we're in October now, but I'm good. I'm good now. I just, I'm hesitant with people driving now, though. I just be like, I'm like, dang, I still have words, but it's like, now it's like, I don't really trust people driving with me in a car. Like, I, I'm very observant now. Very, very, very observant. But, yeah, that happened. The police got my information, everything. We got each other information. Um, honestly, we think that the dude, the person, is not the actual person. We think that we ran inside. He ran inside to get someone else's license and all that stuff. And because, like, if I wish I could show you that pictures, but the pictures I look like another dude in the picture. So, technically, I think that that was his car, and the dude who was driving don't really have um, insurance. That's what I think. But that's for another topic. And honestly, y'all, doing all that investigating days of. I don't got time for that. I'm, I'm grown. Grown. But yeah, y'all, so that was pretty much the end of the story. That's an accident. I'm okay. And I just feel like God was actually, like, honestly, I feel like God was watching me. Because a truck was, literally was coming while I was, when I soared into the other lane, a truck was coming my way. That truck could have hit me. <gasps> Not even gonna lie. That truck could have definitely hit me. But it didn't. Because, like, there was a God, y'all. Literally, everything, it was all God. He literally was watching me, protecting me. I'm covered. I really am. But yeah, y'all. So that was the story. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, yeah, I'm good. I'm good. Even if I'm not good, I'm still gonna tell you I'm good. Period. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. Hope you like my hair. I did it. So y'all, I don't know if y'all gonna see the video yet, but yeah, like I did it, y'all. Like I cut the lace. All that. Yeah, I cut it and I did it. I put it on my head. Yes, I did it.